flock mistakes. Hey guys, it's Kebs. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, let me not be rude. My name is Kebs for short. And in today's video, as you read from the title, I will be giving six, six I hate about being a content creator. If you watch my recent video, I did five things I love about being a content creator, and I'm going to do the opposite of this video, which is six things I hate about being a content creator. Like, comment, and subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up, and let's jump right into the video. You guys, number one. So number one, I think what I really hate about being a content creator is the fact that the process of growing is very, very slow. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, like, look at my channel. I have been into YouTube for a while now, like three years, going to the four years. But next year, I haven't even reached, uh, I haven't even reached 1K yet. The fact that you have to keep making video, you have to keep making content, you have to keep making yourself into it, you have to keep making it perfect, you have to keep trying, 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 and one day your channel just gonna kick up. But it's the fact that the process is really, really slow. I won't lie to you if you are coming to YouTube, unless you are already a fan based person, I already have your fan. Yeah, then it's easier for you once you open your channel, you can share with your fan and people will subscribe. But if you are someone like me who never had a fan base, you know, just style it and say, Oh, I love this, I want to do it. It's not an easy thing. The process will be very, very slow, it will take time, and just keep on trying, you know, it will surely get better. Okay, so number, number two, two is the fact that content creating is very, very expensive, yo. To have that perfect video, that nice video where you see the voice is clear, the lightning is okay, the video is not shaking, the editing is on point, and all of that, yo, is expensive. That's the blunt truth. It's very, very much expensive. Number one, you gotta get a trapper. If you want a good trapper, you gotta pay around 100 and some other dollars. Or let's just say we're going for the less, you'll pay nothing less than 100 to 80 dollars. Let's say 80 to 100 dollars. You need a light. You need an LED light. For a very good light, you got to be thinking about 50 to 60. You know, a lot of things. And you need to buy a microphone, like 35 to 40, 50, a good microphone. And you got to set up the place. Maybe you got to buy stickers to put it on the wall. You got to get a good phone. It doesn't have to be an iPhone like I talked about in my other video. Even if you are getting a techno phone of good quality, you will not pay less than 150 or 200 dollars. So you see? Content creating is very, very expensive. It is something that I hate. If you watch my video that I opened that package, I got a, a light package. I spent a lot for that. And well, it's not the fact that I regret it. No, I don't because you guys can see my video. The quality that right now is late. It's after what's the time? It's after eight. Yep, it's it's after eight right now. This is on. It's eight thirty. Right now it's eight thirty. I'm filming my living room. I'm just using one of my lights one of my light in the living room light is on and you guys can see the place like the lamp in the dining room there is on as well but i'm just using one light and you guys can see the place as lit as it is the place is clear you can't even know if it is lit or if or if it is not so it's the fact that investing in youtube can be a bit not a bit can be very very expensive you gotta be willing to spend the money in order to get it back okay that's going to number three guys is the fact that you have to invest in your time i mean when it comes to youtube it's time consuming because you have to make a video after making a video you have to edit the video after editing the video you got to make sure and editing video is not something that you can do just in like for me i take an hour 30 minutes to edit all of my videos because i want it to be the best unless i'm doing rush hour videos yeah especially when it comes when it has to do with vlogs i take my time to edit it so 
it takes a lot of time before you do video you gotta make research in, in, especially when you are talking on a topic you gotta know the pros and cons of that topic you gotta make sure what you are saying is right because a lot of people watching the video they have open mind to these things some people even know it more than you so you you don't talk one side of it and like people will start dragging in the comment section and say no but what you are saying is not right this is it just be aware that other people have more knowledge about what you are saying more four so number four is the fact that people are not willing to share this is why i'm going to say especially in liberia in africa i don't know why why is it that people take certain things so personal like um when i really wanted to start a youtube channel i didn't ask anybody to do but the fact that people are not willing to share how they do their video with which app they use to edit you know stuff like that i feel like like <laughs> like people take this thing so personal like girl you don't own the app i mean you don't you know you don't own these things like it's there people are watching it like i'm saying you just have to do your own research to learn things by yourself because if you are waiting for someone to show you how to do the right thing like people don't do that a lot of people are eyes when i started my youtube channel i wanted them to help me this 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 at the end of the day they would just drag me around and say oh okay i will see what to do i will see what to do at the end of the day they don't want to share they don't want to tell you anything in everything i keep saying this over and over in every video that i made that everything on my youtube channel i did it all by myself i learned how to edit by myself i use three apps like i told you people before I learned how to do it by myself. I practiced it over and over and again. I learned how to sit in front of the camera to be in the middle to talk to you guys. I have to learn each and everything by myself by doing more research. So if you are depending on somebody to bring to hold your hands and say, come this that for me at least I did which I'll also do more to show you guys because I feel like most of you are in my shoe, that like you don't know how to start, where to start from. And I was once in that shoe before. And I feel your pain. I understand you so much. And it's very, very bad for our community that we don't help people. We don't show people how we do certain things because we feel like if this person gets into it, I don't know. Because YouTube is not just for Africa, or neither is it for Liberia. I mean, there are a lot of people doing YouTube all around the world. So the way you do certain things, some people, it's personal. They don't want to share. They don't want to do it. So if you are waiting for someone to show you, you better you know try to do things for yourself and go a little deeper and make more research and that's why that's that's the full thing that i hate that a lot of people when i not were not willing to share you know they are not willing they was not willing and they up to now they are not still willing to share how to do this how to do that when it comes to youtube and everything you got i gotta struggle on my own and learn about it okay so let's go to number five that you know what i hate is the fact that the support when it comes to youtube is very low in liberia west africa as a whole because it's not that especially when it comes to friends family loved ones like that it's not that um sometimes it's two ways though it's not that they don't want to support you it's the fact that they don't know how to and they don't understand how youtube works yeah i want to say that and another thing is sometimes they know but they feel like well what well, is not me is i don't care yeah you know that i don't care attitude and i feel like in our setting like a lot of people don't support you because they don't have knowledge about youtube how it works or in which way they can help you yeah i feel i feel i feel like that's the way in library a lot of people don't know about youtube sometimes they be asking me like does youtube pay you like how does youtube work Oh, do you have a YouTube channel? And it looks strange to some people like that. Yeah. So that's why, because if a person does not have knowledge or understanding on how certain things work, you don't expect them to support you because they don't know how to explain it. They got no idea on what to say. They got no idea on what to do. So at the end of the day, they won't be able to support you. That's why the support system is very, very low. And sometimes those who already have ideas and understanding they just don't want to support you because it is you and they envy you that's just what i'm gonna say so let's go to the last number six thing i hate about being a content but six thing i hate is the fact that you lost losing subscribers 
<laughs> and I don't know how to say that yes, but losing subscriber, I hate that so much. It's the fact that you know sometimes you'll be like six hundred and seventy, you'll be like, Whoa, yo, I'm growing, hey, I'm growing, hey, I'm growing. And you will go in the morning and be like six um okay, six seventy, you'll be like six sixty five, six fifty. And my whole day will get ruined. Like I'll be like, Wow. Like, why would this, why would these people unsubscribe? Like, what am I doing wrong? Like, why? <laughs> yeah, it's, it kind of hurt a lot. Now, I'm not going to lie about that. It kind of hurt a lot. Like, um, when we did the giveaway, we have a, around 805. And I woke up one morning and I saw we had 800. I was like, where did five go? <laughs> yeah, I was like, but where did five win? You know, but uh, you can grow and drop. Yeah, you gain subscriber, you lost subscriber. Yo, I hate that so much about being a content creator. Seriously. Number seven, number seven thing that I hate about being a content creator is the fact that they, my subscribers hate to engage when it comes to video. A lot of time I post on my community tag where, you know, uh, 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 who and say which video should I upload? Girls, I can this and that, and nobody, absolutely nobody, will go there and vote. Yeah, sometimes I, you know, post a video, and you know, they the views will be high, but people don't like the video. Like you will have seventy five to one hundred and some more views, but you got six like like if you are watching a video, so why can't you just like the video? Why can't you just leave a comment on the video? You know, if I have like 250 views, I think I should have around 250 like. Because if you're spending your data to watch a video, you are not, you don't like that. Yeah. So that's the fact that if you are watching the video, engage in the video, like the video, leave a comment in the comment section, you know, do that, engage in the video. And a lot of time, once you like the video, you comment on the video, YouTube push the video out to other people. But if you watch the video, you don't like, you don't comment, you just watch and leave the video. Sometimes you don't even end the video, you just watch few by and then you off it. Like that, you do feel like, oh, this video is not good, people are not watching it. So, mm, let me pack it right here and not, the video cannot cross, you know, certain boundary. But if you are watching a video, you are watching it from the beginning to the end, you are liking it, you are commenting on it, YouTube starts to push the video up there. And a lot of people start to see it on their For You page. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. Recommend a video that you want to see me do. I'm asking you again, please engage in that. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Hey, bye.